Disclaimer. It's comedy. Hi there, my name is Jack the Fallout and welcome to the Stellar Blade demo. Today I'm going to be playing this and giving my opinion on it. Because despite all of the controversial internet opinions, I think that the combat in this looks quite interesting. I'm going to go normal mode because I'm a big boy gamer. Transmitting final briefing. As of now, Airborne Squad 7 will exterminate the Alpha Nativas occupying District 3. Their objective is the capture or dispatchment of the Elder Nativas. Pods entering atmosphere. One minute until threshold is reached. Helldivers dropping up. Oh no, they're missiles. That is a super cool little detail. I can't tell if they are missiles or sexy women. Probably the latter, to be honest. I know nothing about this, by the way. I just know what people have been saying on the internet. Did I fail? Oh, wait, no, it's open. Okay. Oh, another woman's helping me. Eve, are you all right? This place is dangerous. Take my hand. This is game of the year. I'm joking, of course. I haven't even played it. What the f... What is that? It looks like a living testicle. Star Descent, I'm in the game. I can run around in circles. Ah. I have quick attack. I have a jump. Triangle for strong attack. Alright, I can attack. That's a good thing. I haven't played a game like this in absolute years. Usually I go for like RPG kind of stuff. Can I attach a blade to my hair so that I can attack the enemies with that? Because that would be very useful. I just have to run around in circles. I'd be like, shing, 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 like that. And that would be very useful. Oh. And now it's going to tell me to jump over, Come isn't it? Ha. Jesus Christ. Um, perfect parry by pushing L1. Let's try that again because I'm not very good at perfect parry. Yeah, but I killed it. The combat's actually quite intuitive. I, I I find it quite fun. Hold L1 and press square. Whoa! Whoa! Are you alright, Lee? My body frame. Take this. It's first aid. My body frame? Ah, I use potion. So I can use a potion to fix my body frame. Oh, that was sick. 
the, the way that um, video games are going at the moment. No! They're dead! I don't think that it's necessarily the right way of going. Blaming having women with bodies like this on being misogynistic or a certain way. Women come in many different forms, <laughs> some of which one would deem unnatural. I got hit by a meteor. I'll walk it off though. The destruction is insane. I. It's like they're trying to aim for me. It was. I got hit twice. This isn't looking good. Let's go. What is that? Is that an Alpha Nativa? The Alpha Nativa. Oh, you're dead. Is that a lightsaber? No, no, it's not a lightsaber. Never mind. Oh no, my friend's gonna die. The life signs. We're the only two left. Eve. Eve, pull yourself together. Taki. Listen to me. We haven't completed our mission. Now it's just up to us to see this mission through. Understand? I will do it. For women are strong and deserve to be in places of power. Eve. A sport. It's in the game. Oh, look, it's reminiscent of the IGN staff. Kill it. Slice open its fat belly. I'm being attacked by a Reddit mod who thinks these games are really bad because, for whatever reason, some women are attractive to other people. And that's bad because there are ugly women too. They deserve representation. Over at Xbox, mind you. We like them ugly. And gay! Okay, I'm I'm pissing it off. <laughs> Come on, please cut his arm off. It wasn't an alpha. But it was a strong one. You fought well. Even better than during training. You were all together. But then... Eve! What is that? <laughs> Eve, are you alright? that oh no this is where my friend doesn't do too good bro what the that is the most metal thing i've ever seen Jesus Christ! Oh, I, I knew that was going to happen. Get out of here! Ducky! Damn! This game is savage! I can't believe I was the only survivor. Main character syndrome or what? Something is falling from the sky. A strange sensation. 
Oh, I really hope it's not that rain from Death Stranding. Yeah, it's rain. Oh. We can admire the scenery later. We have a job to do here. I'll admire the scenery here, thank you very much. Falling debris. <laughs> Be careful, Lee. I just got hit with a meteor. I think you can shut up now. What are they? They're coming around me. Alright. Area is clear. Press R2 to acquire items. Passcode. Oh, I found a password. Oh, it worked! Is that what that says? I don't have a double jump. Oh, a weird spider thing. These weird spider things can die. They're like shit scorpions. It's like what happened if a scorpion and an octopus had a baby together. Okay. Oh, camps are places you can save your progress and get some rest. You can rather recover HP there and purchase items. I've got, I'm, I'm absolutely skinned. I've got no money. I like my sword. I like the design of the sword. I always like swords with like holes in the middle. Why not rest for a minute? Oh. Rest part of any mission. Okay, it's telling me to have a little sit down. Reminisce about my dead friend. <laughs> it's literally what I'm doing. What's wrong? PTSD. Uh, it's nothing. That's what someone with PTSD would say. You have to appreciate the physics. I'm sorry, but you really have to. Okay. There's a lot of um, skill trees. I can do a dodge. Okay. So now I've got a dodge button. That's cool. There we go. That deals with that. The disgusting creatures. What? Spit on them. Spit on the non-believers. For a completely new IP, it has gotten me interested in this world and what it what it means because currently I have no clue Eve, on what's going on uh, so it's one of these games where going off the beaten path is helpful because you can unlock There's new stuff box over here. Did someone forget to retrieve this? oh shit oh I died I think doing a demo for a game like this is a really good idea as well because it gives people the a reason like to play it and experience its combat because of the controversy around it. Uh, people are just becoming echo chambers shouting into the void about how sexy women are bad or whatnot. And so there are people out there who will you know give this a go and realize that it's not just you know, ass <laughs> it's more than that it's a, a fun game that just so happens to have ass <laughs> that was incredible yes i i enjoyed that um i i murdered it and along with what i said it also knows exactly what it is as well, and I don't think that's an inherently bad thing. The game doesn't shy away, it's not like, oh here's some powerful armour, it does this but makes your character look good. The game knows exactly what it is doing, but it's doing it in a really smart way. Ha! I killed it before it had a t chance to mutate. I want to get rid of that because I know I can um, deal with the little ones quite well. The scan blocks my vision. I don't recommend scanning while while there's loads of enemies. Oh, the statues can now come alive. Of course the statues can now come alive. Why wouldn't the statues come alive? What the hell are you, you monstrosity? Oh, <laughs> they're flying. I'm not dead. I'm dead. <laughs> Out, you bastard. Oh, 
I cut the bitch in half. No! Oh, f Okay, phew. I'm glad that there was um, idiot proof there. Ledgers are my biggest enemy in video games. Oh, sign. Get out of here, sign. Ah, oh, brilliant. Can I swim? Huh, I can swim. Oh, I can dive too. I like it when games do things that really make you think. Yeah. Oh yeah, this is the famous ladder, the clip that everyone's like, oh look, 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 so look, at, the, this look at the ladder, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna climb up the ladder here. and then I'm gonna climb back down the ladder and then I'm gonna go back up the ladder and I'm gonna be here for a couple of hours. Yeah, okay, cool, we've done the ladder thing, hopefully that can get me a couple more views. Um, off. Okay, okay, your, your hand is disgusting, mate. Oh! Ow! Ha! <laughs> Got him! The combat is good and fun, but sometimes things don't work. It's probably my own stupidity though, let's be honest there. Oh look, trash! Classic human. So this is Earth. Earth is dead. We've, we've understood that. Uh-oh. Ow. Ow, my back. <laughs> I love the fact that the body just stays there. <laughs> what kind of man are you? Are you a... Or a... Ow! Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. I did not see you there. I, you know, this is the problem with these kinds of games. You you get very easily distracted and then you end up dying because you are distracted. This is why they hate these kinds of characters in these games because it makes them worse at the game. <laughs> no! Okay, you've been cut in half. Brilliant. Now, let's not get distracted. Oh my Jesus Christ! Hi. Oh, 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 oh. I ain't got nothing left to protect me. That was, um. Okay, hint. Okay, it's Boko! No, I've got a laminate. Laminate. I've got a laminate of despair. Who laminated despair? You you shouldn't laminate despair. Where do I go? I've got one speck of health left. Go to the Hall of Records. Ah. Okay, the Hall of Records is over here. There's not going to be any more enemies because if I encounter another enemy, I'm probably going to die. No, not you. No, 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 no. No. Shit. Run. Run. Uh-oh. Okay, cool. Okay, that's very annoying. Oh, man. Well, I mean, it's teaching me to get better at the game, I guess. I'm getting better, yeah. Okay, cool. <laughs> it's challenging. Yes, combat hard. Understood. I don't like Mr. Squid. Mr. Squid can get fucked. Ooh. What's this? Oh, looks like this used to be a library. Are these boxes displayed on the wall storage devices? Sort of. They can only store up to one megabyte of data. What a waste of resources. <laughs> <laughs> One meg about a data, I just destroyed unforgettable historical books. Cool, cool, get him, get him, get him, get him. Dead. Got him. Big hearts. Huh. 
Should I lick the plug? What the fuck? Okay, cutscene. Does cutscene mean it's going to be saved now? The crack is quite deep. It's going to be difficult to pass. We'll have to go across, past the parking. So, ooh, is this a safe station? Please be a safe station. A supply camp. Oh, nice. In a place like this. Supply camp? What's that? It's a depot. Set up by the airborne It's a depot, mate. What's that and thing I guess in my hair? This place could be useful for us. The thing in my hair is my sword. Yes, I want blink. Ah, oh, you can you can train your skills. Select this skill tree as to train. Okay. I think I've I think I've got it, you know. I I blinked. I blinked and I missed it, honestly. Ah, oh, yes, this is where I need to be. Look. What the shit is that? That's not an ordinary enemy. That was sick. Adam, get back! I think I'm gonna become part of the afterlife in a minute. I told you. I, I, I'm dead. I think I'm going to hit Adam get back quite a lot. Adam, Adam get, get back. back. Adam, get back. Okay, I get it. Yeah, I get it. I get these kinds of games. My heart is racing. That was sick. The costume is very Kill Bill. I love it.
So this has been Stellar Blade. It's honestly been a really nice surprise. I was going into this. I played this for the meme reasons. And the combat and the music and the story have really intrigued me. And I think that it might actually be quite a good game. There's something called Boss Challenge. The, ah, and I unlocked a new suit. Nice new suit. Brilliant. There's, there's that. So I'm guessing this is going to challenge me to a certain boss. Think this. Stop bushing matting, Jack. Bushing matting. What the? Ah oh, shit. Oh, you can. You fucking. Yeah, so let's leave that there. We don't talk about the boss challenge anymore. And at this part of the video, I want to talk about the beginning. Because I said, stuff said in this video don't represent my true views, which is technically true. But that could also be interpreted to something entirely different. So let's sit down and have a little chat before this video ends. So these are my opinions. I think that people on the internet are pretty disgusting. But I also think that games like this are a good thing as well. So I'm pretty neutral when it comes to all of that stuff. I think if there's a character that looks like a normal person, that character should act and, you know, stay as a normal person. You don't need to use AI to make their ass the size of two double-decker buses. Stop it, you perverts! But with that being said, I also don't throw away creative decisions in creating women with curvy bodies. It's not a bad thing. It's cool. Women come in all different shapes and sizes, some what would deem unnatural, which is technically true. A game like this isn't a bad thing, and I think that it's good to push the boundaries of creativeness. If a game developer has a creative ambition and wants to create a woman that looks like the character in Stellar Blade, I don't think that's necessarily a bad thing. Be creative. Create what you want to create. That's a good thing. But, on the other side, if you want to create a more natural looking human, woman, then go ahead. Be creative. Creativeness is great. Basically, it's all really good. The bad is when people um, on the internet start banging their heads together going, Your character isn't sexy enough, I hate it. Or, Your character is too sexy, I hate it. That's where it gets wrong. Just be accepting of both parties and everyone can get on fine. You know, you're, you're gonna have characters that, you know, look like your everyday Joe and that's not a bad thing. And you're gonna get characters which are got like good bodies and like jiggle physics and everything and that's okay too. They can both exist at the same time, you know that. Stop being fucking stupid. So this is Stellar Blade. This is a really fun game. I really like the combat and I think the story is quite intriguing and I don't know if I'm going to pick it up on release, but eventually I definitely want to give it a go. If it ends up on the PlayStation library, I'll definitely try and play it. Um, I don't know how well I'll get because I'm not very good at the combat, but I can recognise a lot of love and effort has gone into this, and I feel like games like this should be celebrated, and games, games as a general, as a whole, should be celebrated because they're wonderful. Bye! Gun. No, it's good. What do you what? mean, why do I have a gun, Jack? I'm an American. You, you, you this you is have the one a gun. they assigned me yep. at birth. Yeah. <laughs> this is my birth gun.